Hey everyone, Sheila here from Life of Pets. So we have yet another unboxing video and this is probably going to be the last one for a while. We were super excited to get these fish. They looked absolutely amazing online, the videos that we saw of them. And unfortunately, when I was doing the videoing of the unboxing, my camera gave up and I didn't realize. So unfortunately, I only have just some of the footage. So they did send us some free samples of food. And what I liked about these samples was the fact that it did have the ingredients attached they do sell this food as well so this is what the fish have been brought up on which I think is absolutely amazing so these fish did come from guppy train and I will leave a link to their Facebook page in the description box below I have to say I was very impressed with all their communication and it was great to actually speak to them on the phone to go through concerns and to ask questions. So that was really good that it wasn't just all messaging over Facebook, that you could actually contact them by phone and speak to a real person. Unfortunately, this is the part where I lost the footage in that the camera gave up and so they were all very nicely wrapped in newspaper and very very well packaged and as you can see they're all very very lively the coloring is a little washed out but that is perfectly normal with fish that are being shipped so because the temperature here where I live is extremely hot right now they did feel very very warm when I got them out of the box so I did acclimate them to get them used to temp different temperature in the tank for quite a long time I think I left them for probably about 30 to 45 minutes I think actually it was closer to 45 minutes because I wanted to make sure that the temperature really had come down in the bags because they were so warm but thankfully they were extremely active and I love the look of them now this is a trio we do have one male and two females and they are juvenile so they do still have some growing to do they are a rainbow mosaic dragon and they have some amazing colors the video that they sent through the males had pinks and blues and purples and the coloring was just incredible so I can't wait for this guy to color up the females also are actually a pretty nice color too very often with guppies the females can just be sort of a gray color but these actually do have some nice coloring on their tail and their top fin as well so can't wait to get them into the tank and see them color up so this was the male right after he was released into the tank and then this was him a few hours later and as you can see he is really colouring up nicely. I just love the pink sheen that he has in the tail and depending on the light he's all sorts of different colours so can't wait to see him grow up and just see how his colours develop. The females they took a lot longer to colour up so here they're still really very grey but their tail becomes sort of like a blue and yellow and the top fin becomes a blue as well and you can see that here on this footage so very very happy with them they have adapted into the tank really well and I will get more footage of them the next day so that you can see just what they become like after they've been in the tank for 24 hours so after a few hours I did try feeding them and I thought that the granule bug bites would be okay for them because they are really tiny however they were just too big for them so I decided that I would melt down some frozen daphnia and they ate that up they absolutely loved it and then what I did do the following day was grind up the granules and feed them those so it, I will be able to feed the bug bites but I'm just going to have to sort of grind them down a little bit to make them a lot smaller but we absolutely love these guppies the colouring is just amazing on them and I cannot wait for them to start breeding so this tank has everything in it now that we need for it to be a breeding tank for profit. We just need the shrimp and the guppies to do their thing and start breeding so that we can then start selling the offspring. I cannot wait for this tank to get going and see how it turns out. We're really happy with the scaping of the tank and the plants are growing just amazingly. The shrimp are breeding like crazy 
and I reckon there's probably about 50 to 60 in there now quite easily and obviously hopefully in the next few months we will have a lot of baby guppies swimming around so super exciting to see how this tank develops and we've been in touch with a local fish store we've been building a relationship with them and they are really excited to take the shrimp from us and also the guppies we may be selling some of them online but as yet we're not sure yet so just stay tuned for that and when we have an update on it we'll let you know I'm sure many of you are very surprised that we did choose guppies because in the past we've always said that we're not really into them and we have had them over the years but they're just a fish that have never really done anything for us. However, when we saw these from Guppy Train, I just absolutely love them and so we decided that that was the way we were going to go. I have seen several other strains since and I think that we will probably be adding some different ones and doing a different line of breeding as well because there are just so many gorgeous ones out there so stay tuned for that because we may add some more okay guys that's it for this video if you're not subscribed to this channel and would like to see more videos like this then please do so and if you haven't hit that notification bell and you want to know when we upload then if you just hit that then it will tell you when a video has gone up okay guys thanks for watching and we'll see you next time